Spacey Sims, and we are back with more of The Sims for Blackwell Crest, which is our Highlander legacy, after the warehouse. You should be hanging out with your daughter right now, so why are you calling me uh, your real daughter? Anyway, um, so here I am, right? I'm like loading in this game. I come in, she's walking around with it. I'm like, why are my Sims like walking around in their fucking house wearing winter wear? And I'm like, oh, well, and I'm sitting here with a scarf on and fucking hand warmers because I'm fucking freezing, so... Yeah, I can't really judge my... So I started laughing because I'm like, I'm judging them for walking around wearing their hats and mittens and their shit. And I'm like, that's basically what I'm doing in my apartment. Because <laughs> it's fucking cold. Like, I have the heat on too, but it's like... You know, I don't get any sun. So it's like really freaking cold. And like, apparently the two apartments below me just, I don't know, are like fucking popsicles and they just don't turn their heat on because you think I would get their heat. And I don't. And I'm like, could you not be like people who love the frigid fucking cold? Because I miss the old people that live downstairs for me. Because it's like, I never used my heat in the winter. It was like nice. It was nice in my apartment. And like, they, because they must have had it like at fucking 90. I'm like, I swear to God, the bitches that live below me now are like, let's turn the AC on in the winter. What the hell is wrong with you? Do you come from Antarctica? Are you fucking penguins? Balls. Anyway. What are you doing? That was really weird. There was no cat there. Meow meow! I forgot we got kitt kitties. Where's meow meow? Meow meow! Where the fuck are you? Oh, there she is. She's like, I'm going to watch this kitty. How cute! I love my kitties! And the nougat! A grumpy cat! Nougat! Nougat is cold. Nougat, come inside then. She's like, I'm fucking cold, man. Well, get your fucking ass inside. And that's why you're wearing a sweater. <laughs> why she's like, no chance. She's the funniest cat. Oh, I'm glad we adopted all of these cats, including Angry Nougat. Because, you know. Anyway, they're asleep. He's at work. He's sad. Why is he sad? Who died? Oh, right. Oh, God. That's right. It was, um. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. It's fucking. What's his name? It was Elric. Elric, wasn't it? Elric died. Yeah, he did. Oh, Ulrich, I love you. You're one of my favorites. And then you're just like, can you go to bed? Like, he's like, oh, he's too sad to play. He's like, all right, I'm sad and tired. So go to bed. Everyone needs to go to bed. Um, So I debated in the last part, like just revealing the whole plot of this current story. Um, I don't think I'm going to do it quite in this part just because obviously I record like on Saturdays. So you guys are seeing that part. It's up right now um, when I'm recording. So it's like, it doesn't really give anybody the time to be like, no, no. And then I, and then what I would tell you everything. Um, I am going to reveal it probably a little bit sooner than I, because you're going to know, like I have to do certain things to set up things. So you're going to see what happens, but I'm not going to say it all in this um, right now, just in case people want to hold out a little bit longer, but um, we are going to have to do some stuff. So what are you doing? No, do not get abducted. Go back to sleep. No, we're not doing this. I'm not doing this bullshit. Um, so anyway, did our kitty age up? Oh, Tofu aged up! Tofu's not a baby kitty anymore! Oh my god, I am so glad we adopted you! You're freaking lop-eyed! You're not even cross-eyed! Your eyes are going the complete opposite direction! They're, like, going off to the side! Oh, kitty! You're so, like, wrong! You are so... She's so adorable, but her eye... Like, her eyes are, like, all going the wrong way. It's hilarious. You are, like, the complete opposite... What is the opposite of cross-eyed? Like, I don't even know, but that's what she is, and it's fucking amazing, and I love it. I love getting the goofy-looking cans. Anyway. um, So, yeah. So, I think... Are you getting abducted again? No! Go back to bed! Stop it! Why do I have to keep looking, watching you? Stop getting abducted! Normally, I'm okay with that, but you need to sleep, and these aliens need to leave you the motherfucking hell alone. He's exhausted, so he's going to come home and he's going to go to bed. $91. You suck at your job. Can you go to bed now? Can you go to bed now? Okay, hold on. I'm going to just fucking send you to bed, but you're probably going to walk all the way up here and pass out. Sleep. 
I don't know why he wouldn't go to his own bed, but anyway. Um, so, yep. Yeah, so I think the girls are going to age up in this part anyway, but I think I'm going to... What the hell just happened? I think we just had a weird, like, a uh, stair issue, like, level issue. Okay, so she's okay. So I think they're supposed to age up in this part anyway. Let's see. Um. Oh, no. Oh, they don't age up till Thursday. Really? What the hell? That's weird. I thought they aged up in this part. Um, I think I'm going to age them up anyway. Like, I want to age them up early anyway. So maybe I was just thinking I was going to do it. Because he's got eight days till he ages up. They have a couple, but I think... Yeah, I, I mean, I want them to be a little bit younger than him, but not, like, forever. And it's just going to be a pain in the ass for them to be teenagers for a couple more days. And then we can have Winterfest and whatnot. Um, because... Obviously, Javon wants uh, Theodore to marry Rosalie, so we have to kind of work on that. I just, I'm trying to think if I can force them into like a marriage. I probably can without going through like the whole. Now they got to propose, and now they got to do this because. I mean, I could probably set the really. I just don't want because they're not going to have the best relationship. You know what I mean? Because he's kind of forced into this. She's fine with it because, you know, like, whatever. I, and I'm not necessarily sure if she's perfectly fine with it. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like you should have peed before you ate. But, you know, whatever, girl. Um, They're here yeah. for their protection, you know. But I feel like, you know, it's not like she's opposed to Theodore. Like, I mean, he's handsome. Like, he's a good person. Even though he works for her dad. Mm. But, like... I feel like she probably would only, she only does things I think that get adverse attention, you know, like, oh, if her dad hated Theodore, she'd totally be into him, but her dad loves Theodore. So she's like, whatever, you know? And like, I don't think that she's necessarily like, she's like, look, I'll do it to make my father happy probably because he's going to probably like yell at her and like yeah. you're gonna do this and she's like fine whatever maybe he's gonna buy her a new car or something i don't know she seems like kind of a little spoiled like that um so they're gonna kind of be like in this and, and like theodore is like i don't really but, but i don't have a choice because this guy can fucking kill me like because he's in way over his head and it he didn't expect this to happen and now he's like well whatever okay sure fine uh like, Rosalie's fine. Like, great. It's just a sham thing. It's just for whatever. But, you know, I feel like they're going to have, like, a... They are going to have a relationship. But it's not going to be, like, a great relationship. Like, yeah, they have moments where they're into each other. Um, You know, I mean, obviously, because she's... They're going to have to have, like, babies and shit. So, like... She is going to be like, like, yeah, they're going to get, in, it's going to be like that, you know, they're going to get in fights and then they woohoo and then she's pregnant and like, you know, but it's like this love hate relationship. Like there are moments where there's like this like passion between them, but then it's like, God, he wants to like, kill, and like, she's always doing things to like kind of piss him off and whatever. Cause she likes drama and attention and like, that's how she gets it. And it's like, it's going to drive him fucking crazy. Um, so I think I want to age them up. What's wrong with you, kitty? Now, wait for them to respond. It, good, your emotional control. I need, Actually, can I cheat that? I want her emotional control to be, like, fucking, like, goddamn. Can I cheat this? Okay, I want it to be, like, negative 100. I want her to be straight up uncontrolled emotions. That's what I want. I want her to have uncontrolled emotions. Oh, shit, we didn't pay our bills. Can we, like... Um, where the hell is my... There we go. Pay bills. She has uncontrolled emotions. She has no conflict resolution, so... I don't think... Like, I'm not going to change... And I feel like she should also be insensitive. I want her to be insensitive. Can we do that, like, negative 90? Like... Yes! She is insensitive. She is uncontrolled. That's perfect. I need her to be... Actually, I need to set this to, like... I want it to be a little further, so she definitely gets that. 
I don't feel like, I don't, I don't know. Should she have the conflict resolution trait? Should she be a mediator? Let's see. Declaring enemies or despising. Let's see. Sims can pause. Earn one of the fall. Argumentative or, hold on, mediator. I'm wondering if she should have the conflict resolution. Oh my God. She should also be argumentative. She's going to just be the worst. I wasn't going to make her this bad, but. I feel like I'm going to give her a hundred. I'm going to give her the, like, mediate. Somebody needs to mediate between these two. But I don't care if she's responsible. Your good manners. I don't care if she ha if she's compassionate or anything like that. Like, it doesn't matter if she has any of those. She'll be fine. She is going to be, like, the worst. Look at her. Presents tomorrow! That's amazing. I love that. Um, So... He's very sad still from family dying. We're going to have to... Um, Ooh, Yumala. Let's clear bulletin board when you're done eating. And then I'm going to have you pee. And then we're going to... Do we have a cake? Let's see who's calling you. Errol is wondering if I want him to meet... Are you serious? We can't clear this fucking blackboard. Why? There is nothing fucking in the way. What is wrong with you assholes? People can put shit on there, but you can't clear it. What is going on with you? What is your fucking deal? Okay, I'm going to reset you because you're like so... Oh, now he's just stuck. Wow, he's like really stuck. Resetting him did nothing. Oh, dear. Okay, well this is interesting. I don't know what to do. Dancing. No, he's not doing anything, and I can't reset him. Let's just go into cast, and then we'll go back. I know it might age them and fuck everything up, but I don't... It, it's fine. Um, I don't know if this is going to help. I don't know what's going to help. Like, I can't reset him. He's... I might have to go to manage world. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, boop. Okay. We probably lost like six fucking days, but, um, I mean, I was in cast for like 25 minutes to a half hour on one thing and I lost four days on my Sims. So, um, it's not that bad. We might lose a day, but I doubt it. We were in there for like 10 seconds. It took longer to load into cast than I was in cast. It's taking longer to load out of cast than I was in cast. If you timed it by six, I'm just saying. Um, so... Let's see. I don't know if that's going to change anything, but we might have to go to Manage Worlds. Or Gideon's just a statue now. Will? Let's see, where is he? Is he still just hanging around? Well, now he's down here, so that seems good. Um, okay, so can I have you clear bulletin board? Can you come up here and do this? And then we'll have you take a shower? If not, we'll just delete the bulletin board because, like, I don't give a shit. Because, like, we're not going to have teens soon, so... Oh, I think I got a package. Is that what my text is about? Yeah. Oh, no, there's a daily reminder. That's nice. I got one yesterday, but I'm waiting for other stuff in the mail before I go get my mail. Oh, and we're going to have to get rid of those. Yeah, it's fine. So if he can't clear it because of some weirdness, like he can't get to it or something bizarre, I guess not. Okay, it's fine. We'll just, we don't really need the bulletin board anyway. But, um, uh, you actually need to take a shower too. And I wanted to make sure... There we go. There is a cake for our girls for their birthday that we're going to force into. Don't tell me someone else is dead. I can't. We found Rosalie trying to hack into the school computers. Of course she is. We're not sure what her plan was, but we stopped her. Serious stuff. Empathy decreases. She had none to begin with. But she's almost, she's very responsible. Almost. That's fucking hilarious. I want her public image to be negative. Um, no! Don't you eat my cake. Yell at cat! Get off the counter. Anyway. What is wrong with this kitty? Kitty, you need to get some affection. And then you need to eat. 
No, you don't eat my cake, naughty brat. Bad kitty. You naughty bastard cat. Oh, look. Nougat's being nice. Mm, nougat tofu. Don't you eat my cake. Come over here and play. More choices. Play. You need play. You need affection. So why don't you... Okay, here. Why don't you come here and can you... No, go here. What are you doing? Come here and comforting hug and pet and praise kitty. Okay. There you go. Give attention to kitty. Kitty needs... A... Meow meow needs attention. Meow meow needs attention. Meow meow needs attention. Meow meow. Meow meow. <laughs> Let's see if going into cast for four seconds fucked anything up. Now nah, there's... Per Actually... Well, that's weird, because I thought they were going to age up before that. Nine days. Wow, it went backward. We lost a day, because he had nine days. He had eight days to age up, now he's got nine. Okay, so going in and leaving really quick, like, gave everybody a day. Sweet! I was like, I'm pretty sure they were supposed to age up before then. There we go. Now she seems okay. Good. Now my kitty's okay. This kitty needs to go pee pee. Or what are you doing, kitty? Get comfortable, and then you can go pee. Oh, good. You were already gonna go pee. Good. And this kitty's fine. And let's just make sure no asshole cat's eating my cake. Get out of my cake, you bastard! Hey, it's actually she's just playing, so it's okay. Can we come over here and repair? And then, oh, I'm gonna need you to come over here and lecture about eating human food. Lecture about eating human food. Come here and yell at the cats. Yell at the cats, and I'm going to need you to lecture this cat, too. Lecture about eating human food before you take a shower. And then you can take a shower and go pee. And then we'll age Rosalie up. So She's like, no! Don't you eat my cake! It's my birthday cake, you bastard cat! It's vegetarian? Hmm. Vegetarian safe. Yeah. Look at look at my cat though. She's like, what? I not eat cake. Huh? No cake for me. That could be chocolate, kitty. Blow out candles. We're gonna age them up. I know they're this is early, but why does she have that? What is that rainbow? What is it? Oh, is that maybe because she's super energized and happy about presents? You know what I mean? Like, what is it? I don't understand. And then when you're done. Doing all your shit. Um. Kitty, get off my counter. Thank you. Okay, when she's done, I'm going to have you come here and make a wish. Uh. It's weird. A lot of my sims have that. Like, no! No! Lecture about eating human food. Lecture about eating human food. Oh, Simon. No, not right now. I can't, Simon. It's like, hey! Stop that! Bad kitty! And Nougat's like, I'll fucking kill you! <laughs> Nougat's not a bad kitty. She seemed like a bad kitty, but she's not a bad kitty. She's grouchy. She's like, I can't... She's like, I can't make a wish because the cat's in the cake. I know, but the cats are assholes. <laughs> Try that with a bird. No, you can't eat this, but I want it. But you can't eat it, but I want it. But it's chocolate. I want it. It'll kill you. Let me have some. To watch the bird. He like looks at you and he makes me feel guilty because I won't give him food sometimes. And I'm like, there's chocolate in this. You can't eat it. Chocolate will kill you. And he just looks at me like, but I want it. Like, well, I love you, so I'm not going to give you any. I know it seems like reverse, but... Um, I would like to change their outfits, but I'm really concerned about everybody aging up accidentally. Um, I mean, she's fine. I guess they're fine. Like, it doesn't really make a difference right now. So, I just... That's the only thing that sucks. I like to go into cast and change my sims around, and I can't do that because we'll lose time. Um, But... It is what it is, I guess. Okay, can you finish eating this? Okay, good. You're going to eat that. 
I think I glitched him out by doing that. No, she's just being weird. Okay. Flirtatious school day? From a compliment from a cute classmate. Oh, Marin. How dare you? Okay, anyway. So, can I, like... <sighs> hmm. S relationships. I had a relationship with Sim on lot. I don't... Well, I don't want to make them husband and wife. Can't we just do fiancé? I guess not. Um, uh, I was going to do, like, actually, like, have a wedding and, like, force it. But, like, maybe we won't. Maybe we'll just... Fuck it. Uh, okay. Now, does he see her as his wife now? Because, oh, let's just fuck it. Oh, but their relationship is really, really, really interesting. What's this? Oh, okay, sure. Um, but I don't want their... I don't want their relationship to be that high. We'll give them some romance, but not a lot. Their romance is very low. Because it's going to be high and low. It's going to go back and forth. But, like, who's this? Someone's calling her. But anyway. Um, so that'll give us time to, like, adjust. The, and, okay, so. Because their relationship is going to be good and bad and, like, good and bad and, like, whatever. And it's going to go back and forth. And she's just like, oh, my God, wait, did she get any? I aged her up. But, like, what traits did she? I want to see if she. She did get insensitive and argumentative and uncontrolled emotions. This is great. Sims with uncontrolled emotions won't be able to relive their negative relieve their negative emotions as fast as other sims when they have strong negative emotions they may have emotional meltdown that's amazing argumentative sims don't always start conversations on the right foot with sims they don't like successfully apologizing is harder and they do try to assert their correctness more often than not perfect insensitive sims are able to question other sims negative emotions they can also instigate other sims insensitive sims will have a higher chance of failing socially when talking to sims with bad emotions and she's a mediator. She has a higher chance of successfully apologizing to other Sims and can mediate the forums. They can also mend difference, differences with Sims they've not been friendly with for a long time. But I kind of want her to be able to, like, mediate between these two, like, fighting and everything like that. Um, oh, my God, Kitty. Oh, shit. Kitty is being fluffy. This is perfect. So I really did want to, you know, at least force them engaged and then kind of have a fake wedding and, like... You know, like a sham wedding where, like, you know, okay, we actually had a ceremony, but, like, it is what it is. I just don't want them to have, like, a high relationship to start because it's kind of like a forced thing. Um, so they'll be celebrating Christmas together. Um, I'm not sure if maybe we should, like, I think. Um, well, crap. Now I have a cat fur pile somewhere that I can't, I don't know where it is. Where is it? It's probably in my wall. I don't know where it is, but like now my Sims are going to be aggravated. Okay, hold on a second. I need to get rid of those things anyway. Um, I was going to wait because I'm going to get rid of this bulletin board too since we can't fucking use it. I don't know why we can't get to it. Probably because there's a lamp here. The game is stupid as shit sometimes. Um, her pile. Okay, we're going to get rid of these. We don't need these. And I'll just get rid of that for right now. It's fine. We can find a new place for it. There we go. Okay, so we will decorate for Christmas. Um, I'm sorry, Winterfest tomorrow. Um, Winterfest is on a Wednesday. That's really weird. And then it's TV season premiere. And then he's going to age up to an adult. Oh, he's not going to age up at all. And then they age up in summer. Okay. Um, they are in short lifespan, right? Yeah, but they should have 10 dates. 12. Hmm. Hmm. That's weird. Did they change that? I really feel like that's not normal. It isn't short. Oh, you know what? I totally forgot that, like... Our whims are hidden. Oh. You know what? I haven't even noticed. Because I kept thinking about, like, oh, I got to go change and add whims. But <laughs> never.
She's gonna go yell. Oh, this is perfect. She's gonna go yell at her father for this like arranged marriage. She's like, "How dare oh, you? Goodness. You know what? I didn't want this." He's like, "You know what? I thought you liked theater." She's like, "Yeah, but you know what? Like, not to marry him. Whatever." Was he going to work? Oh, he was like coming to pick him up for work. Oh, that's cool. He was coming to pick him up for work. That's nice. Theodore's off to work. I was going to like have them actually like whatever. She's going to go yell at her dad again. I already paid the bills. Why the fuck did you not pay the bills, Gideon? I fucking told him to pay the bills at the beginning of this fucking bar. Why didn't you pay the goddamn bills? What the hell, Gideon? The actual fuck, dude. Pay bills. Didn't do it. What the hell? You want our power to go out? I know he's so pumpkin. Oh, okay, there was no mail aside from bills, but Jesus. Anyway. Um, can we like Can we extinguish all of the pumpkins? We don't need them. I wish we could take the pumpkins and like Can we do that? Oh <gasps> cool, we get money if we throw them away. I was just gonna delete them. I don't know if it like we get money if we like that's awesome. Let's bring these over here. Let's bring these around. Cool. I was gonna just like delete them and think, but I don't know if you get more money for doing that or like. It's only worth sixteen bucks, but if we do it in here, we get seventy bucks because we got lots of cat. Oh fuck. That's the only thing that sucks. Um. I forgot. With that many cats, they can't have a lot of kids. Shit. Kitties, we might have to fucking kill you. <laughs> Just We're not killing our cats. Um, what are you doing? I'm just standing there with the Gideon. Where's he going? Okay, I need to see. Okay. Uh, MC Command Center settings. Gameplay settings. Maximum household size is 12. Oh, okay, perfect. So, good. They can have... Okay, cool. And then we have a closet somewhere, right? For them to... Yeah, okay. Because that's the only way you can edit Sims and casts. I wonder if that... Oh, dear God. Why does everything break in this house? Ugh. <sighs> Oh. Oh, this is just on as if there's a sim in it. Reset? I'm just going to delete this and we're going to get a new shower. If this happens on occasion, it's like there's a ghost taking a shower. I thought the shower was broken. The shower's just on. Okay. We might have some fun new showers. We do. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing impressive. <laughs> like, eh, nothing impressive. That looks like not as good as the one that we had. I like the one that we had. What's this one? No. Where's the one? This is the one that we had. Yeah. Let's just put that back. We sold it to get a new one because it was just running. And now there's like, what the fuck is this? Oh. Did our ship break? A Theodore has been assigned an intern. Assigned tough tasks. Yeah! Good job! Good job, Theodore. I'm so fucking proud of you. How are you doing in your career? Oh, you have to get mischief skills. Oh. We'll scavenge for parts. Unload and put laundry away. Actually, why am I doing that? I'm just going to have you unload and put laundry away. And then we'll have you scavenge for parts. And then we can have you go to bed. Although technically you're allowed to sleep in here now because this is where you sleep with your husband. That's your husband's bed so you're allowed to sleep in there. And the cat's like, look, a new shower! Looking, are you drinking out of a, an imaginary puddle? No, you're just sniffing the new shower. She's like, investigate new object. And then she's like, shit, what's this thing? Must chase! What is that? Um... 
Oh, kitty needs affection. So before you go to bed... Yeah, I'm going to need you to give affection to the kitty. Can you, like, now... Pet kitty? Where did our junk pile go? It's over here. Alright, I'm going to bring this downstairs so we can throw it in our trash. Because we like getting money. Money, money, money! Get fucking money! Um... Okay, I'm going to have you take a shower. Noose. You're yelling at the cat to get out. It's a cat. Have you never had a pet before? They come pee with you, lady. She's like, get out, cat! It's like, um, that's what cats do. What birds do. What dogs do. It's what pets do. They follow you into the bathroom, and they must be with you at all times. Where's she going? She's like, I'm gonna play with this kitty cat. Kitty! <laughs> She's like, hey, crazy little goofy kitty. Little nub and tail. Little not cross, opposite of cross-eyed, whatever that is, anyway. Um. Oh, Tofu, you're trying to chase your nub. You're so cute. Strange little cat. Anyway, I'm going to need you to go to bed. No. No. It's 11.30. So, yeah. So, um... It's going to be hard. Uh, well, I guess we'll start their family next. Um, because. Oh. Yeah. Um, obviously he doesn't want. But then I feel like. Actually she probably like. She should have gotten pregnant before. And then that should have been why they got forced into marriage. But whatever. Maybe she lied and said she was. I don't know. Actually no. You know. She's not that shady. She's shady, but she gets her way from her dad. But I think, you know, I think her dad forces because she was probably involved with someone else in the gang that maybe wasn't as reputable or maybe an arrival like mafia or something like. And he was like, look, look oh, no, 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 Tessa. No, fuck you. You are not going to break all my shit. I'm going to be so mad at you. Oh my god, no. Why? We did not pick up those seed packets. Okay. Don't you break my shit, Tessa! Don't you fucking do it! Girl, don't you fucking do it. I'll beat you. Um, I can't. You're a ghost. But, um, yeah. So, you know, maybe that's, like, why her father kind of forced this. Because Theodore's... Theodore's a good kid. He's like, oh, dear god, this is... I don't know how I got myself into this, but, like... Now he is, and now his life is going to be fucking miserable because he's married to Rosalie. She is a horrible human being. And there's going to be lots of fighting. Lots of fighting and then lots of angry woohoo. It'll be great. Um, If you break that... Fuck you! God damn it, Tessa! I'm just going to replace it because I don't feel like... God damn you, Tessa. Ah, son of a bitch! Oh... Throw away. I was like, why are there puddles down here? Right. Arrow leaves puddles because she's like, I hate my life. She's like, this place is haunted. Fucking ghosts. And they fucking leave puddles and shit. And like, what the hell? She's like, I hate this place. I don't blame you. This place is like falling apart. Like, everything's broken in this house. There's puddles everywhere. I think the cats pee on things. And they're like, honey, it's the ghosts. It's the family ghosts. Oh, sure, Tessa, now you're happy. I just wanted to break some shit. She's kind of a dick. Anyway, um, so yeah. So, in the next part, we'll probably have him and Rosalie, like, they'll have their start their terrible relationship, like, arguing. Oh, it'll be Christmas, too. Um, wait, isn't it Christmas Fest now? Winterfest? Oh, it's not 6 a.m. So it'll be Winterfest. Um, and so we'll have Christmas. We'll have Winterfest. I keep calling Christmas. We'll have Winterfest. And then maybe, oh, maybe she'll get a little drunk and they'll have an argument and then we'll have some woohoo and she'll get pregnant and that'll be perfect. Um, <laughs> so anyway, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.